The next frontier of AI is multiplayer. Most people's relationship with AI today is single player. You go into ChatGPT, you go back and forth, you get a response, and then you take the result and you copy and paste it into a Slack channel or a Google Doc. Well, I just got back from Miro's Canvas 25 event in New York City, and at the event, Ethan Mollick, Wharton professor and absolute legend, said something that has been burning in my brain ever since. The corporate org structure has not changed in 150 years, and every node on that org chart has always been human shaped. The current way we structure businesses was not meant for a world in which intelligence, both human and artificial, can flow freely across every layer. So if you really want to take advantage of AI in your company, it requires a new kind of structure, one where context and cognition are shared, not repeated in single player mode. And this is where Miro excels. Let me explain. Miro has new capabilities like sidekicks, which are basically AIs that help you ideate directly on the board, and flows, which automate multi-step handoffs between teammates and AIs. Put together, this is the infrastructure for multiplayer intelligence. If you want to get the most out of AI, you really have to be willing to do the hard work to look at how your teams and your workflows are designed around AI, not the other way around. And that's hard to do. But if you start moving parts of your work into a platform like Miro, AI will sort of naturally feel like a multiplayer teammate in your business, as opposed to something that you constantly have to manage. I know I'm going to start using Miro a lot more now for this exact reason. It's a platform that I already know and love and I feel like the way that they're integrating AI feels super natural and not forced. The age of multiplayer AI has begun and getting on it doesn't need to be intimidating. It can literally be as simple as opening up a Miro board. If you missed Canvas 25, you can watch the keynote on Miro's YouTube channel to see how these new AI features are reshaping the future of collaboration.